Basically, if it can break, it did break. <laughs> it's back. Oh, there it goes. Is that bent? Yeah. What? Is that bent up? No, no. it just needs spread a little bit. Oh, okay. 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 South, southbound and down tomorrow. It's deer time. Deer time down in Mexico. You boys ever been to Mexico? <laughs> <laughs> We just got to the ranch, yeah. <laughs> doing a little bit of glassing before sun goes down. Jeffrey shot his rifle. Okay, I'm gonna aim right for the kind of the corner of the shadow. Okay. Nailed it. Yep. Good dude. 373 yards and got it. So we're good to go. Excited to find some deer. Excited to get to the ranch, eat some good dinner, and uh, start our hunt tomorrow. Left. Right there. No, more left. No, left. Left. Oh, more left. There's more eyes left. right there. What is it? There's eyes right there. There's no. Oh, there's there. a buck right there. Like 50 yards. Here he went to the end of it. It's behind the tree. Yeah, <laughs> like that one's going good. <laughs> <laughs> There's eyes right there. Maybe we can uh, dump all the sodas in there. There's some slots right there. Jesus. I'm ready. I'm excited. We're gonna go kill some big ones today. It's uh, it's gonna be a good day. I'll have a nap between one and three today. I don't know we're chasing JR, but. Probably getting ready doing work somewhere, sure. Four tags to fill, opening morning of our Mexico deer hunt. Go out there with a full belly after breakfast and... It's good. So it's uh, so it's our first morning out with Jaime and Jeff and then our giveaway winner, uh, Aaron. And sun's come up now and it's lit up most of the hillsides and we're expecting the deer to pop up and start moving any, any point. Uh, but we haven't seen shit yet. That's the thing about this ranch is it's it's a bit of a grind and you know you don't see a lot of deer but when you do see one pretty good chances it's a buck and pretty good chances it's a good buck so and I'd, I'd take that any day over seeing dozens and dozens and dozens of deer like every day and not seeing anything big so got chase with uh, Jeff down uh, a little bit further away they went a different direction we split it Y. We came up here, they went over there, and hopefully they're seeing deer that we aren't, but. Well, we're back at it in Coos Country. First morning with Jeffrey. Victor on the glass, or on the phone. <laughs> we got Mr. Bergman down here, glassing. We got a week of this stuff, it's gonna be fun. What do you got there? 
First luck in Mexico. Ladies, 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 where are you? This morning we found a really good buck for Jaime and made a move on it because he was like 750 yards away and wanted to get a closer shot. So we down the hill and up the next one. And as we were getting ready to leave, Cole asked me if I want the radio. And I told him, no, it's just down the hill up on the next one. We'll pop him and he had nowhere to go. And as it turns out, the hill that we had to walk down was quite a bit steeper into the bottom and quite a bit higher to the top on the next side than I thought it was going to be. And by the time we got up there, the buck had kind of topped out. And then we just lost it. What are we doing, Mr. Bergman? Hey, we are wrapping up. We're going to go grab some lunch. And then uh, I think we have a slight vehicle maintenance repair to make. And then we're going to go back out and find a big giant buck and put a hole in him. That's what we're going to do. Sounds like a plan. Sounds like a plan to me. Here, pictures start to fix. Channel locks maybe would be better. Okay. You got three okay. inches before you hit anything. Okay, so we got to cut it here and here. Kind of like right can here. Can you do that? Do you mind doing that? Yeah, I can do that. There's something about Sazon on Toyotas in Mexico <laughs> that we're good at. Put it right across that. This evening we're just back in on top of the canyon that that buck walked back into and we've got six eyes looking at it and if he stands up if he's here and he stands up he's gonna be in trouble so hey Chase you know what I'm thinking right I hope I didn't pee this direction earlier probably that too no what he's You know, <laughs> I wouldn't disagree. Get a little bit of Larry David back in here. Yes, sir. I probably hold about a pig length to the right of him um, with this wind. Yeah, he's turning. He's starting to turn. Yeah, right there. If you want to take him. Oh, just over him. <laughs> you, you He's coming close. down the hill. Oh, Lord, I see what brings me here. It's a mother to all my wandering. The valley's green will age with me. It's dirt. That might be a different deer. That's a different deer. Is it look good, heavy? No, it's not as big.
Mr. Mota. Did you, uh, good morning? We <laughs> 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 uh, probably can't get you on the radio over there, huh? Day two in Mexico. Had a couple guys show up last night. See how those guys fare today and this morning we're looking for that same buck from yesterday. He's in here somewhere, not too far. We just gotta pick this place apart pretty good and Hopefully we turn up that bad boy. He's a good one. So hopefully we'll get him here on film for you guys and maybe put him on the ground. See how he looks. This is morning number two. <clears throat> and I may call and I are back. Sort of in the vicinity where we left that buck last night. We thought he was at last night. And yeah, we're just trying to dig in and find him call already he found a small buck. But it's definitely not one that we want to kill. So we're gonna open to turn up the, the buck from yesterday. The doe's on the right, on the left side of the tree. The buck was on the right, he's just walked behind the tree. He's not the same buck, I don't I think. I don't think so, yeah. When we first saw him, I saw that big frame, and I thought it was, but it's, I think it's a different buck. He's got way he bigger. the same mass. Yeah, he has thinner, but bigger G3s. Way longer. She's Perfect. Oh, right in the shoulder. Oh, oh. Atta boy. Hey, yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nice nice job, man. man. Perfect. <laughs> Sorry, I took, I, took, I took you guys to ride there. Right. <laughs> it's a dead deer. <laughs> building a Woo! Woo! <laughs> boy. Hell yeah. <laughs> Nice work, man. That is a beautiful buck. Like very tough on him. Yeah, he's right here. His girlfriend was right here. Yeah. Oh no, he's not. He's not broken. Just never drew.
Yeah, hold him, turn his head towards me slightly. There you go, right there. Hey, thanks, Harry. This is good times for sure. <laughs> Nothing better. Well, maybe a couple things better, but not a whole lot. <laughs> Easiest pack out so far. Yeah. That's in the ground. <laughs> that is a damn nice cruise deck. Damn. Beautiful. Making a run for it right now. We found a good nut 993 yards. We're gonna try and lay the hammer down. Put somebody else on the board on a Monday because we already got one down. Somebody tell me what this party's all about. Come look at this buck and tell me what you think. Got another buck up here. Going on, Jay? Uh, just looking at a bunch of deer on the other side of the, deer under the tree? mountain. Jeffrey's uh, with Matt and Josh, and they're uh, making a stock on it. Definitely yeah, that's what I, I said like in the 90s. How many bucks you seen over here this morning, Eric? I only seen three or four good bucks. You can move that one to where you need to. Got glass on one really good one. <laughs> See what he looks like when he stands up. I'm Jay, by the way. I didn't meet you. Richard. Richard. Back on him. He's 3:30. He's 10 yards to the right. Going behind that tree. Yep. He's behind that tree. You're gonna have to move to the left. Can you still see him? Yep. Coming out behind the tree. He's in the open. You hit the rock in front of you. You hit the rock. You gotta move. Go down too low. You cannot shoot from there. Walking back towards you guys. Jeff, Jeff, move, move five feet to the right. He's walking around towards us. He's broadside. Shoot him right there. Shoot him. If he's here, he's Shoot stuck him. it up at the four star. Right there. Shoot him. Wow. Right there. That's offhand. Shoot him. Handing broadside. See him. Can you see him? He's stopped broadside looking at us. He's in the yellow grass. He walks 20 yards down the ridge to the right. He came down through that gray stuff. And he's standing there broadside. He's walking to the right again. You can't see him from over there. You need to get up and move left. That. Or the right. Right, right, right. Far right as you can see. See that big tree? Come straight down from it. Jeff, more to the right. So look with your eyeballs. See the big white trunk tree? Yeah. The lowest one you can see on the hill. Yeah. You got him? No. He's walking towards us. He's right at that tree. Oh, there he is. Look at that. He's going to step in the open. Wait for him. Yardage. 300. When he turns, kill him. Oh, he's, tree. He's, he's broadside, ready to go. Just to the left. Just hold, hold on the left side of that tree and be ready. He's coming. He's coming out. Come on, Lord, make it happen. Three hundred. Let's 
here. Got him? No. Can you see him, Jeff? No. He's too far to the right. There you go. That way, Jeff. The, the tree that you're looking through is going to come out to the left. He's going to go behind that. There, I got him. Crush him. Two. He shot right behind me. He came towards us. He's in the open and the yellow grass. Right on him. Dude, they ought to be like running down that hill, finding a shot to place to shoot. Find the big tree. It's like a mushroom and right. it. Come up at one o'clock. At one o'clock from that tree. Yes, you can see him wide open. Do that twenty minutes ago. Just shoot out the tripod or shoot out this tree. Hey, shoot out this tree right here. Shit. That's what I do. Watch out. That one missed. Wasn't very steady either. That last shot, we couldn't hear. I couldn't. It didn't sound like a hit though. But I have not seen him come out on our side. Did he come out on your side? No, I'm pretty sure he's dead under that tree. We never saw him come out. <laughs> okay, he looked real sick after that second shot. Make sure that they saw blood. Tell him. Tell him. We got a good one here, boys. That's called a gooding. What do you think there, Jeff? That's a pretty nice deer, man. Just what I was looking for. I'd say that's a gooding, Bubba. <laughs> Jeff did well for his first time, man. Excellent, excellent but morning. Two bucks down and it's not 10 o'clock yet. And we got our pack mule, Mr. Josh Smith. Why don't you turn Viva a little Mexico, bit? Mexico, mother Turn around a little bit so we can see that pretty, that pretty back up there. Boys. Oh yeah. If you ain't know, that's a good one. Beautifully. A f f 150 rolled into town and it's not 11 o'clock and we're already heading back to the ranch house with two of them down. Where's that clock at? 1102. You gotta say for yourself, Matt, on this trip around, this time around. Every time we bring this truck down here, it goes like that, you know, noon and we're already having a badass lunch, drinking some cervezas and scoring deer. Liquid lunch. Liquid lunches. <laughs> <laughs>
What the f just happened? At least it got you home first. Yeah, I don't know if it's a the gasoline. Is it running now though? Yeah. You got some uh P Mix in it? Yeah, but we yeah. got the Nova. She gonna be alright. <laughs> Handle it. <laughs> oh shit, son. <laughs> Thanks, man. Freaking awesome, dude. We're Thanks, man. We were watching uh we were watching the hill. I found a couple does. Where was he at? Um that stuff I was telling you last night. The the, the green hill? Yeah, the, all With that the stuff in the trees, yeah. Okay. So we were glassing and I found the does and, and I saw a little pork horn pushing the does. I'm like, oh shit, it's not a shooter, man. It's just a little pork horn. Freaking, so I start glassing, he's getting the BPX out. I point him to where the does are. He's not so little. That's the biggest deer I've ever killed, man. I couldn't be happier. Got three of them today, that's... Oh, there's another one? Every, everybody got. Holy smokes. Well, it's not everyone, but yeah. yeah. <coughs> I think that's a good bummer.